anybody commenting? So this morning through producer Dave Cobb, who leases this incredible studio, RCA Studio A, um, I was able to come in here and play some music and kind of soak up the vibes a little bit. Been listening to a lot of country music in the last couple of years, so a lot of history, a lot of memories here come through um, the music that I remember, the music I've been relating to, and there's something about the place that makes music seem better, and I start to relate then why so many great records um, were made in a particular place or artists were attracted to that place. So being in a studio like this, where some of the most famous country songs in particular were ever made, and uh, you can imagine if the walls could talk type of thing. Here we go. Let me just set our little friend. All right, here we go. And three, two. Currently live in the RCA Studio A, Nashville. And I'm pretty sure, although I can't be sure, that the song I'm about to play for you was recorded next door. Um, so I'd like to thank producer Dave Cobb, who leases this space, uh, for letting me in here to uh, broadcast live to you. I can't understand, no I can't understand How life goes on the way it does why does my heart go on beating? Why do these eyes of mine cry? Don't they know it's the end of the world? It ended when you said goodbye. Facebook. Yeah. I, I walked in, I'm like, he can't be him here. He can't be him here. <laughs> here I am. I'm kind of fascinated by like lost worlds, you know? Well, he put it, got this thing. But he put it. What? Could you get like a stamp photo of yourself? I've never seen that before. Wait, wait, wait. Does this look like AC3? The crazy thing is a lot of these old cameras still work. Back in the day, you had to have some money to buy one of these suckers. Format anymore with this camera. It's like, this film is like, imagine the negative is this big. So the, the shots would be amazing. Just can't get the film. My antique find of the day. 1933 World's Fair from Chicago. I, I will. I'll try to admit it. I find that getting out into the country it. really helps. Um, you know, when you tour, it's you're in a bus, but when you drive and stop and talk to people, and it kind of reminds you of like what's important in this country and.
kind of focus me back as a songwriter to talk to where people's heads are at. I am Mrs. Alabama, United States. Current. Current. Raining. 2016. I'm wow, congratulations. Yeah. So, cute. Gillette Beer and Sign. Nice to meet you, yeah. Local attorney and part-time judge. Oh, that, should that disqualify you being an attorney? It really should. <laughs> <laughs> so it like I <laughs> Have you seen that Muscle Shoals documentary? I have. I thought it was great, but it makes it seem like Muscle Shoals is a small town. Yeah. So I went there thinking like it was going to be this little backwater town, and it's actually a pretty big town, so. Wave to America. Yeah, perfect. Oh, great. We want people following and, you know. I mean, we're, we're all kind of, you know, pioneering here in social media building through. It's kind of cool. I, I just, being in the elements, you know, you kind of, the music's a reflection of whatever your environment is. And I'm so used to playing, you know stinky halls and old theaters it's nice to play in the elements and kind of draw from the, the byways and the highways Three, two, one. hello everyone we have patrick corgan here on the 30-day roustabout we are currently in killen alabama on our way down to muscle shoals and uh, we saw this picturesque background here and just couldn't resist i uh, hope you can hear me it's a little loud right by the highway. Okay. What you wait for? 